Yo, dudes and dudettes, my name is Speedak Podiete, but you can call me Speed for short, and welcome to something a little bit different. Um, this is my Kirby's Dream Land walkthrough for the, uh, technically Game Boy, but I'm playing this on my 3DS because, I don't know, fun times. Uh, this is actually, okay, funny story. I, when I was a sophomore in high school, I did a Let's Play of this game. That was three years ago. And I remember just having a lot of fun with it. And this game came out in 1992, which makes 2017 its 25 year anniversary. So uh, I realized I haven't really shown Kirby any love this year. And uh, I'm, I've been playing Team Kirby Clash Deluxe a lot for the past week and some change and I played a little bit of Kirby Planet Robobot and I really like that and thinking of buying that game but so you know the other day I was like you know what I'm gonna slap down some money and buy Kirby's Dream Land on the virtual console it was only like four dollars and it is just as fun as I remember it and so I figured let's you know do a let's play of the game again uh, you know this time with uh, a little bit of a twist, um, if you press up, select, and A on the title screen, you can activate extra game. This will is basically the challenge mode, which is what I'll be playing through. Uh, this walkthrough will work for the normal mode and the extra game. The only difference between normal and extra is that the enemies are slightly varied, and so there'll be different enemies and their attacks will do more damage. But um, yeah, other than that, Let's uh, go right on into it. Green greens. Oh, and I'll be doing one stage per video. So the videos will be a little bit shorter than normal. Uh, Kirby controls are, oh, D-pad to move around. Uh, press up to fly. Press B to inhale and to exhale. And then press A to jump. And that is pretty much it. You can Whole, you can press B to inhale an enemy, press B again to spit it out as a star. And that is the entirety of the gameplay in this game. That's it. If you ever see an end, you can go inside and get these water bottles. Water bottles are sort of like two little HP thingies. Oop. Uh, I'm also recording at a really weird angle because uh, I usually use the the D-pad to play these games and the D-pad is like right next to uh, the camera on my phone that I used to record these videos. <gasps> uh, I bet you're wondering why I paused the game just now. It is because I want to show you guys something uh, kind of interesting that you probably did not know. Okay, maybe you did know it, but hey, I felt like showing it to you anyway. It's something incredible. Do you see that? Kirby is the master of time! The whole world is on pause, but Kirby doesn't care. If you actually pause the game for more than 20 seconds, Kirby will start dancing, which is quite awesome. And I'm about to get hit, aren't I? Oh! So this guy, Poppy Bros Jr., you just gotta inhale his bombs and throw them back at him. Ooh, I'm actually doing pretty well. This is not easy at all. Trust me, the extra game is so difficult. I feel like it's almost... Not unfair, because it's it's definitely fair in like in terms of like if you die Okay. If you like if you die, like you know you could have avoided dying, basically. Hope and uh, I should also mention <laughs> that the last time that I actually beat this game on extra mode was like also three years ago. I'm pretty sure. Okay. 
So, if I die a lot, I'm sorry. <laughs> jump, jump, jump. Take that light guy. But uh, it's definitely a fun game. I'm thinking like, I want to do some some other Kirby videos on the channel, you know, this year too. Uh, probably more of them after I'm back at school. But I figured, yeah, Kirby's Dream Land. It's a game that I've already let's played before, so I know it pretty well. And I don't know it like the back of my hand. Like, I know Pokemon Platinum and this game pretty well. So that's usually like my criteria before I decide to like let's play or do a series in the game is like, do I know it well and is it fun? All right, this is Wispy Woods. He is a gigantic tree who will drop Gorons and apples. If you're playing the normal mode of the game, he will only drop apples. Uh, the Gorons take away half your health, so don't touch them. Or else you will die. A very painful death. You kind of got to, like, skill jump your way out of not dying. Not dying. Not dying. Oh! If you're playing the normal game, he will throw only, ouch, only apples. All right, back at it again. As I was saying, wispy. He did not just do that. Mother of Gorons. A Goron Hills. Yeah. Bang, bang, bang. Woo! So, okay, that one was pretty easy, but it was only the first stage. So, uh, that is it. Yeah, these videos are going to be pretty short. Just a little fun times to mess around and, I don't know, play some Kirby. Because let's, let's, let's look at this guy. He's so cute. And whenever you beat a level... <laughs> okay, this is not funny. Come on, guys. <laughs> He'll dance for you. My name is Speed Akpodi Etsy, but you can call me Speed for short. And I'll see you guys next time when we take on Castle Lolo. <laughs> Cue the end card.